Yo, 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 what is up, fam? Thanks once again for tuning into the channel. So this is Kicks World, where we talk everything about sneakers, streetwear, travel, and everything in between. And today we are going to be talking about Supreme's newest 2019 drop. It's for the fall and winter, so a lot of it will be like cold items, where, uh, not cold, like things to keep you warm, like winter items, winter clothing. And they also have, of course, some of those weird and wacky uh, collaborations they do with all these kind of different companies. And we'll talk through with them in this video. Anyway, guys, thanks once again for watching this video. If you do like it, please give me that big thumbs up. If you like the content, please consider subscribing. Anyway, let's get into this video. Okay, so we are here at the Supreme website. You can see this. So let's just get straight into some of this uh, stuff that they have here. What's really funny is uh, like uh, this. Um, I'm not really laughing at the model, but like, yeah, he's got one of those really funny um, uh, mustaches. Those Asian mustaches like I do, that they only grow sideways they don't actually um grow like connect <laughs> anyway so he's wearing some pretty cool stuff as you can see there the eight ball the eight balls are really popular uh mm -hmm. collaboration by martin wong he does a lot of uh you know uh a, there's a lot of pieces that he's done uh, also these different really out there pieces obviously because every time like supreme drops something they always have to try to do something different so they always have all these really cool items let's get into the uh the items as a whole so these are all the items that uh supreme's dropping very interesting you can see there some of the main ones that you can see so they're really luxurious uh i just say that because it's, it's leather leather usually is a high premium thing and uh you can see here the eight ball so uh, the eight ball is a lot in is in a lot of these pieces by martin wong uh very very cool you know uh, very old school and retro, if you, if I may, and it comes in two colors, red and white. So a lot of these are there are a lot of different kind of items in this one. I've never seen this before. They have trench coats. Uh, it's sort of like this. Uh, oh, it's a window pane kind of. Uh, how to say this uh, pattern? And they got it in different colors, which is really interesting. So it's, I think uh, Supreme is trying to branch out into the kind of smart, casual kind of vibe, not just in the. Um, the uh streetwear kind I'm, I'm sure that they've, they've done it before but they have a lot of pieces here you can see you can see there there's sort of like a overcoat trench coat as well that they have a lot of winter items which is something i really like also this piece this is my favorite piece this is the gore-tex down jacket very very cool black supreme uh branding around on the chest and uh, gore-tex on the uh the chest as well i like this why because it's water resistant obviously and it's got uh how do i say this it's very very warm so i i really think that this one would sell out it will be very expensive resale value will very, be very high like a lot of these other items um in terms of uh the, the best uh, selling price uh, best selling and best resale value pieces would i think this one would be one of them because um what's cool about it is it, it does have this really fire print on it but not just that guys you can see that it is reversible so you, re you can have another it's like two jackets in one basically so i think this would have very high resale value it's really cool it's very bold as well so you stand out a lot and it comes in all these different colors as you can see there they've got a, a brown like sort of desert camo stripe kind of thing and it comes in in darker colors as well so very interesting because it has two patterns so a lot of bang for your buck there uh, also a lot of different kind of down jackets and all this kind of stuff. Um, how do I ask is it? They have anoraks, uh, like this one. This is another water resistant uh, piece. Very interesting nylon anorak. So, uh, you know, it's got the high, um, I think those are pocket sleeves on the side and very adjustable, um, uh, drawstrings for the, uh, the hoodie comes in multiple colors. Also this guys, what I'm trying to say is they really try to get into the whole, um, fashion side of things it, like th this is a formal suit you know a, sh a shark skin suit so the only brand that you could see is on the inside lining so oh i don't know why isn't it oh, you can see there so the inside lining is it says supreme and also the tag there that says supreme wow they're, they're really trying to get out like you probably wear this if you're a hype beast for your wedding or whatever <laughs> but they have a lot of items as well uh you know uh, another eight ball 
uh, thing. I don't, I, I, I'm personally not a fan of it, but I do think it will sell out. And it's a, it's a good sort of like a Hawaiian shirt, you know, to wear. In terms of uh, resale value, I don't think it will be very high. It's just really interesting to look at because there are a lot of them. Um, also, they got the uh, the hockey jerseys as well. That's dope. I think that's really it's it creates a very a, a cool athleisure look. I think these will have some high resale value as well. It will sell out like every piece of supreme. Oh, look at check this out, guys. This is sort of like a, a velour baseball a jersey. Super sick. I am a big fan of this. This will definitely sell out. High resale value, definitely for sure. And it comes with matching shorts. You don't need the shorts, but it definitely looks it's a it's a it's a vibe <laughs> when you actually um put it together it looks really dope but plain black shorts plain black pants would do this that's a sick outfit you know um also they got this really cool uh t-shirt here it says drama <laughs> so a lot of people whenever they like during the supreme drops there is a lot of drama so it's a, sort of like a coincidence that they they did this kind of thing and it comes in multiple colors <laughs> uh also another supreme um uh, hoodie with this eight ball by Martin Wong. Uh, once again, uh, this one, uh, I'm not feeling it, but it, this does have that kind of vibe about, um, you know, the blood and semen one that came out, <laughs> I think it was last year. That was kind of funny. It sort of looks almost the same, but in a different way. But this one looks a lot more like normal in a way because it's just an eight ball. Anyway, what else have we got here? We got the really, this is what I'm, I think this will be the most popular one for everyone because this is the box logo, the bandana box logo. Definitely sell out. This will definitely have high resale value. So if you can get your hands on this, definitely go for it because it comes in a array of multiple colors as well. Uh, definitely the black, I reckon the gray and the blue probably be the most popular. Everything else um, it will probably have a, a, like a somewhat like a kind of a, a, a smaller value in terms of resale, but this will definitely all sell out. Some really cool pieces there, uh, very outlandish uh, pieces. Also a lot of camo print. That's what I noticed. And they have a, 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 an array of pants. These are the shorts that I was talking about that match the little uh, baseball jersey. Very interesting. Uh, just only a couple of t-shirts, but they have heaps of hats. They have so many hats. Um, bucket hats, bell hats, and they have these winter hats as well with the side paneling here with the fur. Woo! Definitely for the cold uh, winter. Uh, winter. And uh, they got this Russian hat, <laughs> really, really interesting. In terms of uh, resale value, I think the hats would uh, definitely go for a lot. A lot of beanies too. Now let's get into some of these really interesting items. Uh, the, uh, one of the probably uh, really popular items would be this one as well, the backpack. Backpacks obviously are accessories, so you can use them all the time. So they definitely have, uh, you know, you can get more bang for your buck in that, case, uh, in that sense. So the black, uh, uh, water resistant bag will definitely sell out. It would be very popular, have high resale. And uh, you know, it's, it's something that you can use all the time, not like a t-shirt, you know, where you can wear it once and then you have to kind of be careful when you wear it again because you don't want to deteriorate the quality of the t-shirt. Whereas bags all the time, like the shoulder bags and all this kind of stuff, you can wear as much as you want. It's supreme. Like these ones, this is definitely really good for those really, uh, the, the Asian countries that have high humidity where it's always hot. You don't always want to bring a, a bag, like a backpack around because of all the, the sweat kind of things. Whereas if you have just a shoulder bag, use less energy, it's really good. I think those would definitely, all bags, all accessories like that for Supreme usually sell out and have good resell. Um, I'm not really feeling this um, Frankenstein kind of patchwork <laughs> uh, backpack. Uh, it looks really uh, luxurious, the, the, the leather, but I don't, uh, they'll, ha they'll have a higher fetch price, but I don't think they'll be very popular. Now the craziest item here, let's go to it. Bang, right there. This is the Supreme Honda motorbike. It's it's like a dirt bike and oh my gosh, I can't believe they actually did this. This is crazy. They uh, they did so many uh, collaborations before with Fox, the like dirt bike, um, you know, apparel, and they actually made a dirt bike. Uh, only real hype beasts would probably get this, or really rich people that just want to flex. I doubt people will actually use this in real life. If they do, props to them, but a lot of uh, resellers probably buy it so they can put it on their shop for display for people to take photos with. That's what I reckon. Also, they have this really cool and unique phone. Blue, the phone company collabed with Supreme and they just made this phone. What a weird and wacky um, you know, collaboration. Very interesting, but 
<laughs> I don't know, it's just really weird. Oh, but also, by the way, guys, if you know anyone that's got a pinball machine or like really big items from Supreme, how do they ship it to you? I really want to know how you, the, the logistics happen when um, you try to uh, you know, do these kind of things. Let me know, guys. Uh, also, they have a watch. Really, really cool. Uh, very, uh, you know, uh, like a subtle flex because the Supreme's in the, in the background where it's backlit. Really cool, interesting. It's a watch and you can wear it all the time. I do think they'll have high resale value because it's very useful. You can wear it every day. They have Hanes, a lot of the Hanes ones. The Hanes uh, items, I don't really believe that they go for a lot of uh, resale value because they make a lot of them. And usually they're one of the pieces that's left behind at the store, one of the last pieces because you, they can just make so many of it. Uh, I know lighters as well go for a lot. So there's a lot of really weird items, especially like the, the, the weight. They have this, they, these hand weights, dumbbells. They're five pounds. There's a gold and a silver one. To me, the best that you could use for these, the best purpose is probably like a doorstop or whatever. <laughs> but they have a voodoo doll as well. So they have all these kind of different items. Very interesting. And they got a lot of skate decks. Um, uh, probably, you know, there are a lot of opportunities to make money from these uh, items, especially from the clothing. There is a huge drop. I, I don't know exactly how many drops they're going to be doing, but very cool, very uh, you know, unique once again by Supreme. But my, definitely my favorite piece is the Gore-Tex puffer down jacket because it's very useful and also one of the shoulder bags because you know you can never go wrong with a shoulder bag because it's you can always put it there you can always use it and it holds all your essential uh items like your wallet and your uh your phone anyway guys let me know what your kind of favorite items are of this drop let me know in the comments down below and if you do know how to the logistics go with uh you know uh, you know like the pinball machine and the let's say the uh the the motorbike how do they how do they ship it to you how do you receive it <laughs> it's really interesting anyway guys thanks once again for watching this video if you liked it please give me that big thumbs up and if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel we're almost at a thousand i'm really excited so all your help and your support is so much appreciated guys thank you so much for watching my videos and i'll see you guys in the next one peace